Well, hello everyone, and thank you so very much for joining me for this week's reflection. I'm Susan Short, and I serve College Lutheran Church in Salem, Virginia, as the Director of Music Ministries. I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Pastor Drebus for coordinating this week's Midwinter Power in the Spirit Conference that has focused on the theme Candlemas, a festival of illumination. Each day has included a morning e-devotional that has been filled with various scripture readings, words from pastors around the Virginia Synod, as well as an art project. Evening sessions have consisted of live virtual workshops from topics ranging from managing stress and a system challenged by a pandemic, seasons of stewardship, the postures of prayer, and the power of questions. At the conclusion of the evening workshops, we have closed with an online evening prayer service that has been led by congregations throughout the Virginia Synod. It has been a powerful and meaning, a meaningful week of reflection and fellowship. I have definitely learned that Groundhog's Day doesn't quite hold a candle to candle moss. I do hope you're planning to join us for drive-in worship this Sunday, February the 7th, beginning at 10 a.m., the gathering hymn that Maria and Josh Sherman will be leading is Marty Haugen's Gather Us In. The words are provided in today's reflection and can also be found in our ELW, the Red Hymnal, in its hymn number 532. Our congregation is very familiar with many of Haugen's hymns and compositions. We have used Holden Evening Prayer as well as Now the Feast and Celebration for various worship services and gatherings. Our choir has sung Shepherd Me, O God, as an anthem, and our services regularly include the hymns Healer of Our Every Ill, All Are Welcome, and Gather Us In. Haugen is a composer, workshop presenter, performing and recording artist, and author from Minnesota. He was raised in the American Lutheran Church and received a bachelor's degree in psychology from Luther College, Yet his first position as a church muse musician was in a Roman Catholic parish. He received a master's in pastoral studies at the University of St. Thomas, located in St. Paul, Minnesota. Gather Us In, which was written in 1982, represent Haugen's skill both as a poet and a composer. As an opening hymn or an entrance hymn, it calls the Christian community or assembly together. When asked what his inspiration was for this hymn, he responded, and I quote, Gather Us In was written after I heard the wonderful text, What is This Place? I wanted to craft something that might say and send a similar message to North American ears. I deliberately wrote it in second person to avoid gender issues and to more directly sing to God rather than about God. Ironically, that has been at times a problem for some who would like God more carefully um, um, circumscribed as well as named. So let's take a moment to walk through um, the various stanzas of this hymn. In the first stanza, we find that this community is one of hope, where new light is streaming. It is also a community of honesty and inclusivity, where we can bring both our fears and our dreamings into the light of this day. Stanza 2 um, continues um, this description of an inclusive gathering, both young and old, rich and the haughty, proud and the strong. It also indicates that this is a community that has a history and that the purpose of this community is to be a light to the whole human race. Definitely a reference to Matthew 5, verses 14 through 16. Stanza 3 articulates a sacramental uh, community where we receive the wine and the water and the bread of new life. The concluding stanza classifies or clarifies that the work of the kingdom takes place neither in the dark um, of buildings confining nor in some heaven light years away. The work of the kingdom takes place now in the midst of the gathered. Whether you are or aren't a fan of Haugen's music, his work continues to shape and contribute to worship experiences throughout the world. I've included two recordings to gather us in in today's reflection. The first is an organ performance, perhaps an improvisation called Fantasy on Marty Haugen's Gather Us In from an American Guild of Organist leader from California. 
The other is a vocal recording by Marty Haugen and several of his friends. So again, thank you for joining me for today's reflection, and I look forward to seeing you for Drive-In Worship on Sunday, as well as singing together Marty Haugen's hymn, Gather Us In.